everyone to the sold out Staples Center in downtown Los Angeles, California. It's the home of the Lakers, where we're broadcasting live today for 2K Sports. I'm Kevin Harlan, along with Greg Anthony and Brent Berry, our terrific analysts. I know he scored more than I don't know why I'm not in the picture. Looking at San Antonio, they took the win in their last game against Portland. And always tough on the road, but that attack mindset that they brought offensively, I really felt like that set them apart. And sometimes when you're pushing the action, you can see some great teamwork, and then all of a sudden the individuals on your team can take over. I mean, sorry. He's checked in for Los Angeles. For San Antonio, they have hit just two free throws and five attempts today. On the floor for San Antonio. Gay is the three right, with Aldridge go. at the four. DeRozan out there with Young. And it's Gasol and at the five. Oh, I just got, almost got In a backcourt violation. James. McGee in the high post. Is this Young on me, bro? I can't Basketball. get around him. Lakers working the ball around now. Okay, that was and nasty. James throws it down. LeBron gets behind the eyes of the defense for the highlight reel jam. And a tremendous Unleash Chaos replay coming to you courtesy of Under Armour, Hover Hammond. Aldridge kicks to Young. A rebound by the Lakers. Coming into this, having notched a win against the Rockets Shoot in their it. last game. And, and I know the defense wasn't great, but yet and still, their ability to stay composed was impressive. Well, it, it led to a big scoring effort taking advantage of every weakness so any possession the defense wasn't aggressive on they were on the offensive end good and aldridge gets the assist young's got five you know effective from the interior young is someone who looks to score once he's that close and that one clearly a foul gets the whistle and two shots coming up that was super yeah, lucky i would have missed Marcus young Lakers shooting their fifth and sixth free throws of the game. Only 71% from the line last season, and rest assured they're hoping to bring those Gentlemen, numbers up this two year. Two shots. Two shots. The first free throw is good. And the Spurs now in the post Kawhi Leonard era of the franchise. Uh, Greg, how do they recover, do you think? If any team can survive losing a player of Kawhi's caliber, it's got to be the Spurs. They have good depth, got a good return in the trade, and players will step up. Won't be the power they once were for a while, but they'll rebound in no time. And the wide-open shot from Bellinelli. That three off the mark. You know what, though? Sometimes you can be too open. I think it may have surprised him, and that's why he missed. The kick out to LeBron to the paint. Here's AI. Yep, it counts. This is as good as it gets for first quarter in terms of shooting the basketball. Spurs trail by seven. Murray, the pass to Bertens. James against Murray. Outside, Bellinelli hits it from three-point range. Get a steal. Bellinelli's got himself going there. His first points of the game on the deep ball. And we've got an update here, so let's check in with David Aldridge reporting from the sideline. Well, Kevin, Greg Popovich and I talked Should've for a few him. minutes. It's the first matchup of the season against this team, and he knows that they have great shot blocking. But he did say we've got to remain aggressive and continue to attack. Put the bigs in high pick and roll situations and shoot the jumper with confidence. They feel that's the key, Kevin. Thanks for the report, David. Guys, just how difficult is it to face a team with this kind of defense? Kevin, it is tough. They've got some guys who can totally wreck your game plan with their activity on D. I also wonder if this is going to give them a spark of their own on defense. You face a team with this kind of pressure and it can get you fired up to prove that you're every bit as tough as your opponent. Really, the right play defensively if you can't block LeBron and Kuzma make up the forwards AI is out there with Harris and it's McGee in at the center position that's who's in the game for the Lakers the kick out to Young <laughs> San Antonio again missing. Lakers trail by yeah, three. LeBron James on the wing. Up top, Kuzma. 
AI outside. And he hits it yeah. to tie the game up. AI's got his third basket of the night right there. You can blame some poor defense on that play. Just a total breakdown. Oh. Got to at least contest at some point. And it's good for two. And started hot, and he's only gotten harder. The Lakers have gone 5 of 12 from the field here in the second. Shot from 16. Again, Los Angeles. His release is just so smooth from the mid-range. San Antonio's gone 2 of 4 from three-point range so far in the second quarter. Knocks it loose and stolen by LeBron. From outside the arc, Kuzma can't get it to go. San Antonio's gone 3 of 7 tonight from three-point territory. And Young kicks to Aldridge. Young outside. DeRozan passes to Gay. Down low. Here's Young. It's deflected. Not here. For Los Angeles, they've gone 6 of 14 that. shooting here in the second. Pass to A.I. at six from deep James frames okay, the three-pointer and it's a three-point Laker lead and it just seems that every pass they make is leading to a score just great ball movement just one second between the shot clock and game clock young outside and there's the foul it'll go on AI that'll be his second foul of the game 12 seconds left here in the second. And here's Mills. There's the pass to DeRozan. And it's blocked. And the first half comes to a conclusion in a game that has been very close so far. Lakers lead by three. We'll see you back here after the break. <laughs> the start of the second half. Neither side jumping out ahead through the first two quarters. A platoon swap here for the Lakers. So San Antonio going with an almost entirely new group here. Jakob Pertles checked in for Gasol. Bellinelli comes oh. in for Rudy Gay. Maurice checked in for DeMar DeRozan. And it's Mills in for Young. On the court right now for the Spurs. Aldridge out there with Pertle. And it's Mills. Then there's Murray. And it's Bellinelli in at the small forward so difficult to defend Aldridge inside. He can go around you or shoot over you, pretty much whatever he wants to do. Lakers leading by five. And here's Rondo. He has seven. He kicks it to AI. Shoots off the screen. Ellenelli pulls Man, it in. No doubt disappointed with that one. He'd love to have that one back. Yeah, I put that play on repeat. The setup was perfect. Just need a better result next time. Aldridge sets up the pick now for Murray. Bellinelli passes it to Aldridge. Shot clock at six. Oh, and that one had the right spit on it, and it is good. And now just a three-point Los Angeles lead. Rondo kicks to Ingram. AI in the post. He's coming We're by better Murray. than that. Come on. The Spurs have gone even 5 of 10 on shot attempts in the third. Pass to Mills. Here's Pirtle. Instead. Murray for three. He can't get that one to fall. There's 117 left in the third quarter. It's deflected. And it's out of bounds. The Lakers able to retain possession here. Let's now pause to take a look at the scoring breakdown between the front and back court of tonight's contests for the Spurs. And it's been guard play which really has shouldered the burden offensively here. They'd like a bit more production from the front court, but in the meantime, this backcourt has kept them in the game. Now he's a heady player. He knows how to get himself going and giving his team a real advantage right now on the offensive end. And we've got an update here, so let's catch up with David Aldridge. Well, LaMarcus Aldridge and the Spurs got through some tension in their relationship early on. Now, Greg Popovich said, it became apparent that it really was me. 
He'd been in the league for nine years. I'm not going to turn him into some other player. That was just silly. So we took care of it, and he's been fantastic. Guys? Uh -oh. That's why Pop okay. is the there best in the business, DA. He's always going to figure it out. Thanks. And after really leaning on that three-point shot in the first half, seeming like they're uh, just getting away from it here in the second. More of the shots coming from the interior. Los Angeles making a switch here. Caldwell Pope's checked in. Hills with it. He's got five. Aldridge, the pass to Murray. Aldridge. And it's Rajon Rondo with the foul. That's foul number two for him. Rebound. Aldridge dishes to Murray. Aldridge kicks to Mills. Back to Aldridge. And another shot. Persistence pays off as they finally hit a shot. Aldridge has got eight points. And you gotta love the big bucket in the paint. Oh, that was terrible. Grind it out game. And offensively, a great show for the fans through the first three quarters. It's been a fun game to watch. Los Angeles on top, up four. Luke Walton had some advice for his team. Let's hear what he had to say. Be strong with it down here. Get good looks. On that end, we keep getting stopped. Great defense, great defense, great talking out there. So he is loving the effort on the defensive end. As he should, a supportive coach who knows when to give his guys some credit. Welcome back as we get rolling once more. The fourth quarter right ahead in what's been a very well-contested game. A moment now to reset the lineups. Damn. Are you listening? Damn. Uh-huh. 